Hey guys, we're back again from another video. This episode, I promise that I will make a mob grind. So, in between episodes, I farm a lot of woods. So, I'm gonna show you how much and then I make a lot of dirt now. Look at it. As you can see, we have almost 11 stack. We only need 4 more. So, overmove one. Today is gonna be big. So, by the way, off cam, I make a uh, coal. Just, you know, burning some woods and getting some coal. Like this, bro. So, yeah, this might be the easiest thing to do. So, I'm just gonna deposit this. And then, we're gonna go make this mob farm. This one is the most efficient way without water. So, yeah. So, we need only 8 stacks. I'm just gonna store some stuff that we don't need. We need this axe, though. Yeah, so this should be a long video, or maybe not, because I'm just gonna speed it up and I'll tell you what to do, okay? So we need this, we need a lot of woods though, so, yeah, the, so this may take a long time. The top of the moves is different, because they drop a cookies, and that cookies is the best item in this game because it will give you a random item like if you like this you can get even iron blocks yeah, if you got lucky <laughs> so we need about nine of these I'm just gonna get 10 and then 24 of these stairs so we're gonna just open some new places so maybe in here we're gonna make this in here okay Let's break this. Make this our new place to go. So we need to make a lot of slab now. So guys, this is the base platform of our mob farm. So you, what you're gonna need to do is make a tree by tree, a nine grid. This make it two blocks high, but it's you're using the slab because you don't want any mob to spawn in your mob farm beneath without torch if you're gonna do it if you're gonna make a mob farm this early let me take this so he, yeah as you can see you can go fit in here in this bottom after you build this we're going up 24 blocks high and by the way, we need a lot of button on this. Because it's gonna be... Because the way the button works is that the mob think that it's a block but it's not really. And then they just fall into that place like this. You just put a button in here. And then they will just like walk. They think that they, there, there is a block but there's nothing in it. Just a button and then they drop here. So yeah, I'm just gonna build a 24 block height. So see you in a bit. After you reach the top, then you're gonna need to do is craft a button and place it like this. So we need eight. Yeah, one, two, three. Oh shoot, I forgot. Sorry, because I have OCD. <laughs> so 
you put it in here in there so the way this work is that they the mob think that these are blocks I'm just repeating saying it but you need to understand this okay so if they, th they think that this is a block and then they just jump over there and die so that that's how this move farm work okay so we're gonna make a two wide cup to make the mob spawn so this is the starting platform so the way it works is that the, mo the mob spawn in here in this two platform and then what you're gonna need to do to improve this is that we'll build another layer of it okay so I'm gonna put this break that it will make three block high okay just gonna make this okay so it's gonna be easier so I'll cut it out and then show you what I did if you go in here you just need to put some blocks in the middle right so you're just gonna put some some oak buttons you need about lots of these after you build after you're building you build this you have like this form this is a uh, this is efficient way to make the mob spawn because they will spawn in here and then they just spawn in here too in there too so that's about efficient but there's another way that's so efficient okay i'll show you add another layer so we are in a pretty bad shape now because look at that look who's there that's the pillager <laughs> my gosh i hate this this is the three layers look like so as you can see we have a middle part which have a hole in it so you just put like this buttons and buttons here so that way they drop in here and there there you go so yeah after this this we just need to add the roof okay so i'm gonna cut it and then do that so as you can see we need to make a step slab because we don't want mobs spawning above because that will low the increase the spawn rate of the mobs because they're just gonna spawn above so what we're gonna do is put a slab and put a block to cover this hole because if you put a slab just just a roof no mob will spawn because it's not a what you can say a block that can that can that can block you stupid the sunlight okay if it's i'll give you an example if you put a slab and under the above the torch you can you can see the the light but if you put a full block the light they will gone so that's why you need to make this it's expensive <laughs> yep we're done now we just need to do the last part so easy now hope there's no mob spawning hope so so yeah this is how you make the mob farm without water by the way the enderman cannot go in here because it's too too gap they cannot go in here but uh, what they can do is to teleport over here Let's see where is the ladder that we make, where is it, right here, so let's, oh shoot, not scary bro, so I'm just gonna mine down, then let's put this thing and then fight that freaking pillager that we have in our base, so yeah, this might be here we go. Hope they're not angry at me. Hope yep, they don't. They place the trap doors that we crafted. Oh, oh, first that. <laughs> As you can see, it's so efficient, bro. So yeah, just do this all around. Even not around, so you can just. If you if the mob die you can just do this and then grab this oh and that's the new way to get a lot of 
gravel by the way so yeah this farm is the pretty cool farm I guess and then we got our two cookies wow we got we got lucky bro so can we defeat the villager using with the soon sword though no, no. so let's hide I think they're not mad so yeah yeah we're just gonna get the sword shot me still breaking so now let's defend defend you coward gay <laughs> hey gosh and then yeah we pretty <laughs> killed that punks <laughs> so yeah let's grab our lucky cookies like it's like a lucky block but it's it's eatable so what we get oh oh what the heck what the heck bro for protection tree in turns too <laughs> yeah boy what <laughs> we got pretty lucky bro next item is we got a spider egg wow oh my god wow <laughs> what a lucky man next is oh we got bone block that's pretty useful though but it's not just for today because we have pretty got a lot of stuff <laughs> then just our luck day we will get and we got pretty infinity whoa what what the fuck what the heck <laughs> what's the chance of that getting an infinity bow bro i think there's like a new thing you can do about this Basically, you can shoot the cobblestone. Maybe I'm wrong. So let's just test it. So we're just gonna craft another. Let's craft another bow. Let's try one. Or let's try all. <laughs> let's make sure. So if we shoot this. Bruh. Nothing. So yeah, just a waste of cobblestone. So what we're gonna need to do is to make a stone cutter. Yeah, stone cutter. We need stone cutter. It's basically stone cutter in this map or this advance. It's pretty OP, you know. Because literally can, can give you anything, any block. So this is a new mob drop. A custom mob drop. It is a bone crook. It's much, oh, it's much stronger than the other one, and it have a sharpness too. This is one, yeah. And the creeper gave it too. So, so we'll drop, you know. The other quest gave us one iron ingot. So I was just thinking, what's gonna do about it? Then I just thought about this stone cutter. This might be the the one we need, stone cutter. So let's see where we can place this. Maybe above, yeah. Maybe above like that. So yeah, this is how. Oh yeah, <laughs> bro, we need this. Okay, we need this so bad. So I don't wanna lose this. So we need this. A freaking grindstone. By the way, if if you can tell. We got obsidian shards. It's the the most important thing in this gameplay because what you can do about this it is to make a fabricator. Okay, so we need four of these. We only need some. This might be easier, you know. So glass, obsidian. I think if we smelt the this. Yeah, we'll make it into a sand. When we cook the sand two times, then if we grind some things, oh no, flint. You stupid. Wow, our move from is pretty good, you know. Look at this stuff, man. Oh my gosh, we got four. If we get lucky this time, we might get uh, a head. Because some of these trap give us a lot of things. So yeah. I'm just gonna cut it out and then make uh, anything progress. 
Yeah, I'll see you a bit. Okay, guys, we're back again. Now, we got pretty lucky in in just a little bit because I grind so much. I'll show you something that's pretty cool, you know. You will see soon, okay? Just wait. Let me organize this. So, basically, I eat a lot of lucky cookies. And guess what? I'm pretty lucky, boy. Yeah, boy. <laughs> yeah, boy. So, I'll show you what I got. By the way, we can cra we can now craft the freaking terrarium. Yes, terrarium. What does th what does that do is that we can no longer need to freaking break this tree, which is automatically breaking itself. So yeah, I don't know if you can understand that, but we're going with it, okay? So as you can see, we got pretty lucky. We got lucky bow. Lucky armor, two piece, and we got. Oh, where is it? Here we got the lucky golden hoe and even lucky golden bow. Oh my god! Wow! And then you can see it, but here, boom, we got monster spawner. Yeah. So, yeah, before we craft that, we need. I will eat some cookies and wish me luck that I will get it, okay? So yeah, let's just sleep and get that last cookies. This and see what we got. By the way, oh shoot. Why are you always interrupting my video? <laughs> so now, we got the double compressed dirt. That's what we need to make this freaking terrarium here. So I'll show you in a bit after we eat the 16 cookies. So finger crossed guys, if we get lucky, give us iron please. We're not gonna open our winter and look down so that we can see what the item that drops, okay? I see leaves. That's a bad luck. But it's okay. We can get, we can eh, come back for some stuff. Oh, potions. The more stuff dropping. Oh, what the heck. Did you see that guys? We got freaking lucky. Ooh, compressed clay. Oh, almost drink that. Wow. What the? Oh my god! Wow! No way. Are you freaking kidding me? A dragon's head? <laughs> no way. Are you serious right now? These freaking lucky cookies give us freaking lucky. <laughs> my god. Even zombie head. Wow. A compressed cobblestone and double compressed gravel. Compressed gravel, double compressed curse. Uh, wait, <laughs> we have that. Co double compressed red sun. My gosh, what the heck? Now let's build the terrarium and then just, just remove this thing because we don't need it anymore. Because we, basically, this this fabricator makes makes a lot of easier now because it will eventually give us wood so yeah so now we clean that now let's put this here okay so how this work is that you need to to have a dirt we have dirt okay now just break it boom here it is the holy fabric <laughs> now if we Place it with dirt, not a compressed dirt, because that doesn't work. Place dirt, and then we put a sapling like this, and then it should it should work. Wow! Look at that, guys. As you can see, if it grows bigger, it will go back to its tiny mat. So yeah. And boom and then make a sounds like that and if you open it we get a stick yeah <laughs> stick still uh, the add-ons maker didn't know how to fix this this unknown so bear with it because the important thing is that it works okay the important thing is it works so that's all you need to do okay so now I'm just gonna improve our base a little bit Maybe because we have a torch, now we can just make a 
pretty good na base. By the way guys, unfortunately we're gonna end this episode because it's taking a long time and I cannot see how to get this freaking firestone so maybe next episode I'll get it but I have to do something yeah so last two oh, lucky cookies make sure we get something awesome and oh we got saddle oh that's rare yeah so yeah thanks for the support and there's a floating llama <laughs> hanging llama I mean wow what the heck how was what did the owner do to him <laughs> well we don't know so yeah so I'm gonna end this video today hope you all like it this this freaking thing is so freaking OP so yeah I'll see you in a bit stay safe in your house also and I will see you next episode. Goodbye. Bruh.